Hey produce people, so I'm here at Jungle Gyms. We're gonna go inside, we're gonna check out this massive store and see what kind of produce they have to offer. Let's go. Any store that has a big orange, a banana, and a strawberry out front is probably the right store to go to. Follow the signs. Hi. Good. Would you guys like to try a fig from Jungle Gym Pictures out there? Sure. We picked this morning. So a fig from the fig tree? Figs from the fig tree. Thank you. From toys to figs and more. Let's go. And what's cool about this, they even have a podcast right here at Jungle Gyms. Haven't even made it to the produce department. Check that out. So if you look at this structure right here, this Jungle Gyms, the original Gyms building, in 1974 and then they built around it so this is actually the original jungle gyms right here which is pretty cool and then here's obviously the grocery store which we're going to check out a lot of cool items look at that campbell's soup <laughs> display and sign it's pretty cool as we walk through this grocery store is massive, everyone. It's definitely an international market. I mean, this cheese section that they even have right here is amazing. I, I still even haven't even found the produce department, so we're just gonna keep walking through, and uh, we're gonna find it sooner or later, trust me. If you need to le use the bathroom, this is where it is at Jungle Gems, all right? Check it out, right there. And as we exit the bathroom, we looked at Jungle John's. Okay, so this map shows collectively the best restrooms, everyone, in America. Guess what? They won, because you're literally walking into a porta potty that is a mansion. Old Jungle Jim himself. Ross said the produce department is coming, but we uh, we blocked this entire store. No, we've not even walked a quarter of the store. Yet. Not even a quarter, and there's no windows. All right, we finally made it to the produce section in Jungle Gym, so we're gonna walk through and check it out and see what we can find. Little miniolas from Peru. Some of my favorite pistachios are these honey roasted uh, wonderfuls. Some blues, baby. Some pink pineapple. Ross is over here with some pineapples here with the, the pink pineapple. Check this out. Kiwis from New Zealand. Apples. Favorite. Oh, of course. Cotton candy grapes, baby. He even likes to mess with me. Good apples. Look at these massive red grapefruits from South Africa. Massive South African red grapefruit. I like the stocks are, are really stocked. Apples are looking low. Where are these from? Honey crisp from chili. It looks like chili honey crisp has been hot on the list right now. 80 acre farms. It's local. It's just kind of cool. I like that local. Have your own microgreens, lettuce. Oh, we got the Kiss Melon by Dulcinea, the Sunny Gold. Oh, it's not a Kiss Melon, it's just the Sunny Gold. Look at the inside. It's a yellow watermelon, everyone. When's the last time you saw a yellow watermelon? Comment below and let me know. Let's see what we got here. Navel oranges from Chile. Pineapples, everyone. Oh, there's these gold kiwis you can bite right into. Nice little display right off the bat. 
They have a lot of these uh, pistachios everywhere. <laughs> well, this is the 80 Acres Farms Fresh Fruit Awaits. That's their handle. That's pretty cool. There's Ross. I don't know what he's picking up. He got some more grapes. Look at the dragon fruit. Let's check it out. Oh! Oh, wow. That's amazing. Have you tried the red dragon fruit? Have you tried this one? We should get it. You should. It's, it's a must. You got to try it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Trust me, that will not disappoint at all. It won't. A lot of grapes. Actually, they have the white flesh and the yellow flesh. The question, Ross, is have you tried the yellow dragon fruit? This is probably the best one. It definitely is. I think so. Look at those ginormous peaches over there, too. Look at those things. Amazing. Oh, Dulcinea again. Look at that. Another Dulcinea. Darling. These are, these are all imports. These are from, let's see, packed mandarins. Hey, all we these. Just, did we just interview Hatch? Talk to Hatch? Young Guns. Look at that. The this Hatch Manzoid. Valley chilies. We just did. Look at that. And we got the Young Guns green chili. Amazing. Look at that. So we spoke to the farmer the other day of Young Guns Chili, and now we just saw the product in the store. So that's kind of cool. I think it's awesome. Some fresh, cold, fresh juices. This looks familiar. Look at that. Bottled by Trinity Fruit out of Fresno, California. I think we got to pick this one up just to support our uh, Trinity Fruit Company Mandarin Juice. Throw that in there. Cucumbers, rosemary, oh my gosh. Look at it. Look at it. I didn't even see. Look how big this produce department is, everyone. And it even wraps around past the boat. Produce deals. Now. You got a whole produce section full of deals, everyone. Reduce your shrink, I bet, by giving some good deals out there. So check this out. We can walk through. We can pick up produce deals, stuff that's ready to go, but is ready to be eaten right off the bat. You got mangoes. You got rambutan. You got long guns. You got cauliflower. Got some plums. And you even got some plums, everyone. So you got to check all of this out. Look at the produce department, everyone. Let's go. Let's go ahead and take a look at the peppers. interesting pepper how it grew us all Mexico greens reds Cuban sweets graffiti eggplants jalapeno peppers we'll watch out for these ones listen we got a lot of good fresh produce everyone the shelves are packed meaning that it is fresh and ready to go it's watermelon time can't beat a fresh citrus and banana section Let's not forget, organic, simply delicious. Don't panic everybody, because it is organic. Look how fresh this store is, from radishes, to carrots, to literally everything you need to have the day set off. We gotta get some corn, I'm telling you. Dan's favorite celeries from shredded carrots and more. Ross is calling me over here for something. What is it? We got Bianca and Fruit World with their organic Tom Cord grapes. Those Tom Cords, baby. Those are some flavorful, flavorful grapes. And the walls of the organics. Hands down, this is like a wholesale grocery shop. I have been walking the produce department for more than a few minutes and seen more than enough. Even look at this banana display. And just in case, you've got Gilligan and the Skipper, Lucky Charms and more for this amazing Tropicals display. Look at the Tropicals. And then right over to the largest dragon fruit. Oh my goodness. Look how big these from Florida. are. These are from Florida. Fresh from Florida, right there. Uh, well, the sign says Florida, the sticker says Ecuador. Yeah. 
Wow. And these are always baby pineapples. Oh my gosh. For years, I would always say the U.S. needs to bring in these little baby pineapples. Call them little grenades. Look at them. They're, I love them. They're amazing. Got to pick up a baby pineapple. More tropicals. So they tear that whole row down every day and put it back every morning. And fresh ice, everything. It's an incredible operation. So what we got over here, it looks like the international fruits and vegetables. So we went from desk domestic to now international, which you're gonna get a lot of different, you got yucca, shirley, coconut, plantains, just a different set, different variety of tropicals, radishes, and more, look at this. Hey, would you look at that? I like how it's nice and cut too. Can't beat Jungle Gyms, everybody. Hey, as Dan the Produce Man says, it's always best when you get it. Jungle Gyms fresh. Thank you for visiting the Produce Industry Show. If you liked the video, please hit the subscribe button and follow. You can also check us out on Facebook and Instagram at The Produce Industry Podcast. We'll see you in the fields and on the horizon.